We tell stories at Milwaukee PBS. Here's one you may have missed. And now we meet the women who named themselves the Whiskey Bells, an all-female musical trio based in Milwaukee. Their music is a unique blend of classic country, folk, and Americana music. These sweet singing songwriters perform versions of favorite songs along with original tunes filled with catchy lyrics that will probably make you want to dance. How's everybody doing today? And we are the Whiskey Bells. <laughs> We're from Milwaukee. This is called Borrow Trouble. So it all started about 10 years ago, and then um, this uh, arrangement has been around for eight years. Whiskey Bells just kind of had this ring to it, and it kind of stuck. My name is Kimberly Unger. I play fiddle in the Whiskey Bells. My role is I'm basically the, the only soloist in the band, so I would take what normally would be a guitar solo and play it on fiddle. My name is Sarah Moylanen, and I play bass in the Whiskey Bells. I kind of play it in more of a bluegrass style, and it sort of lays down the, the bass rhythm, because we don't have a drummer, so Chrissy and I have to uh, make the rhythm happen. My name is Chrissy. I play guitar in the Whiskey Bells. It acts as a rhythm instrument. I think I play it a little more uh, percussively than most uh, acoustic guitar players. And so, like Sarah said, it replaces the uh, drummer. Well, we got our sound from a trio, which is Dolly Parton, Lynn Ronstead, and Emily Harris. So we started off learning uh, that album and kind of figured out where our sound was. But again, that was 10 years ago, so we've definitely evolved from there. I guess you would categorize this as like Americana slash bluegrass slash traditional country. We really, I mean, we do everything from Dolly Parton to Beyonce. Yeah. You know, and it's just, it really kind of depends on what speaks to us. And, you know, I think this would be a really fun thing to try. We kind of take our own personal take on the songs that we play. Like, we don't play them like a like a traditional cover band cover band does. We kind of, we whisk it, it, you know, mm -hmm. we, we make it our own. And country's such a dirty word, too. I know. Yes. <laughs> yeah, like I don't even like to say I like country. <laughs> I like good music. I like good music, yeah. Okay, so where do you want to start? Let's do the song again. Usually we come with an idea or a song already written and then we play it and then it develops from there. So mm -hmm. then we create the arrangement around that to really fit the three of us. Mm -hmm. And I think that holds true for every song that we do, yeah. whether it's an original song or a cover song. Right, and most of the time we're adapting songs that don't have three-part harmony into three-part harmony. So it's fun to try and you know make all three of our voices work together on stuff that you wouldn't normally hear it on so and that's the best part yeah arranging and being creative with whether it's our songs or something that you hear on the radio
it wasn't until that I played with the whiskey bells <laughs> where people just stop and they're like, three women all playing their instruments and all singing and all just be in these powerhouses. So <laughs> it's a lot more fun than, than solo shows. My favorite thing about playing out with these ladies is that we can just do a song a cappella with it's just our voices. And I don't think people, I don't think people realize that it's really us singing at times. And we just work that hard on our harmonies where you know, it's it's tight. And so when we stop and just play a cappella and sing, yeah. it's just it's neat. When you see us smiling on stage, it's genuine. Like we, there's no other place we'd rather be. Now we love we, to perform, yeah. and that is, I think, it transcends onto our audience, and they really can feel that that joy and that energy. A lot of people, oh, I don't, I don't really like country, but I really <laughs> like what you guys do. That to me says that we're doing a really great job at what we do. Just When you sing with people that you connect with on such on a level like this, it's like you're giving a part of your soul to your audience. And it's a very vulnerable place to be, but it's it's so rewarding on so many levels. And to call these ladies my friends on top of that, it's just it really is amazing. We've just spent so much time together. It brings us a lot of joy. And again, I think that people see that when they come and see us play. Well, we were friends first. So friends first, and then we became a band. Watch the Arts Page on Milwaukee PBS and watch online at milwaukeepbs.org.